Hi, welcome to the Ask Jima series um, where I take questions from clients, from just anyone out there um, that has any specific question to ask me on trading, on money, on psychology, on wealth and things like that. And then I try to record a video to try to answer those questions for them. And um, so in today's session, um, I have a couple of questions. Um, that I'll be going back and forth from my computer to um, to the screen and um, because some of you will require me to go actually to the um, trading charts to kind of answer some of the questions. So the first question really is from a guy called Ernest. Um, Ernest asked me, can one be a profitable trader without using any machine or robots? So what he's asking there is, is it possible to succeed in trading, become a good trader um, and profitable trader without using automated systems um, um, and any robots out there in, in the marketplace. Um, I will answer that question by first asking a question um, and then I'll take, take the detail. Um, before 2015, 2016 or even before the 2000s, people have always been in the market. Um, 1929 people have always been in the market and in those times there were nothing there was nothing like um, uh, algorithms the way we know them today um, and so people have been successful trading um, um, the financial markets without any need for automated systems um, when you, you heard of of, um, of Judge Soros Judge Soros um, is, is regarded as the man who broke the Bank of England and um, he shorted the GDP um, on this particular day, and um, and um, the, it was reputed or it was it was reported that um, that the Bank of uh, Bank of Bank of England could not um, even get enough money to pay him um, when the pound crashed, um, and so they had to go borrow money um, to actually pay him, and that's where he made most of his um, a lot of his wealth from, and um, from that one trade um, shorting the uh, the GDP when there was a. Uh, when it was about to um, um, go weak. Um, so he didn't use any automated system to do that. Um, he just knew how to time the market and then, um, um, or time situations because you can't really time the market. Um, he just knew when to take um, um, the, the such trades and he did it well. And the reality is automated systems are just a, a combination of algorithms, um, um, codes, um, logic actually put into numbers, which means it's still based on some human saying this is what I expect the market to do, if that happens then you need to take a trade. Um, so the first level really is to make sure you know what you're doing, which is the human. Um, so if you can, you can go after automated systems as much as you like. If you do not understand what the automated system is doing, you might have a good automated system and you still lose money using it because you do not have the, the fundamental knowledge and understanding of what the automated system is doing. So the first thing you need to do is to make sure you're a good manual trader. And if you're creating your own systems, like I do create my auto systems, um, if your manual system is crap, the automated system will be crap. You can't make it any better by just automating it. And so the, it is key you understand things manually. Now, what's the beauty of the automated system, which is what I do? Um, I don't trade manually anymore. Um, all my trades are automated. Um, I still want to do manual trades from time to time, but I just can't do it. And that's the point. Um, I, I didn't really want to spend all my time sitting down watching charts. And no, there are, there are lots of things I can do for the world. And I'm out there trying to do better for the world, do better for clients and stuff like that. And I like to do that. So I don't want to be in front of the chat just sitting in one place and, and um, trying to monitor what's happening in the market. And no, I don't do that anymore. My automated systems take my trades for me. But however, I haven't said that. I still have a routine that every single day, at least twice a day, I am not just on my phone. Um, you, you must understand this, I don't just look at trades on my phone. Anyone that tells you that you only need your phone to be successful in trading is actually not telling you all the truth. Successful trading requires you to have um, some other means of analyzing the charts um, apart from your phone because the phone is very limited on how you can analyze um, the charts. So I, I ensure that at least twice a day 
um, sometimes more. I actually uh, am looking at, and um, supervising what my automated systems um, do for me. I don't like to call my automated systems robots. I call them trade assistants. And so because they are trade assistants, they just help me manage my trades. So whilst I'm sleeping, if an opportunity shows up, the automated systems will take the trade. If I'm out helping clients somewhere, if an automate is if I, if a um, strategy shows up, it takes the trade. If it needs to manage the stop loss and the targets, it also does that. It just does automated um, for me. Um, but I still can come in any time, look at the trade here, look at the conditions around in the market, and decide to intervene manually and close the trade. So that's the beauty of an automated system. Uh, another thing too is. Um, for instance, yesterday on the 5TT gap strategy, on some of the brokerage accounts, we had over 10 opportunities show up once the market opened. So once the market opened at 10 p.m. UK time, Lagos time, once the once that once that um, the, the first tick was received in the market, you see the gaps then. Now, if you're manually trading, you will. It's not going to be possible for you to execute entries for all those 10 trades in a second. Now, that is what an automated system can do. Automated system can just, independent of each chart, can just get into the trade at the same time. So 10 trades will get in at one second after the market um, opens. But as a manual trader, you can still do the 10 trades, but it might take you um, two minutes, one minute or two minutes, as against the one second that um, the automated system um, uses to, to do it. So you can trade manually. Um, you don't have to um, trade um, automated. But there, there is, um, there is a lot of benefit um, using automated systems. Just peace of mind. It takes away the psychology as well. For me, the other thing too is, is the psychology bit. I don't want to be sitting in front of the chart, holding my head, pulling my head, trying to wonder if price is going to go up or come down. Um, I don't want to do that. Let the automated system, once the rules are met, do what I've asked it to do. Um, and um, all this emotional roller coaster. I don't want to be involved in that. And so the automated system helps me do that. It's not a problem if you can handle it. Um, go ahead and do it. Okay, I hope that helps you out, Ernest, um, and answers that question for you. So yes, go ahead, trade manually if, you, if, you, if that's how you want to trade, and you can make a lot of money doing that. Um, if you also want to do automated, yes, why not go ahead and do it, okay?